So today we went to the Holy Land experience. Uh, we've never been there before, um, so we just thought we'd we'd go and see what it was like. Um, I have some very exciting news about the Holy Land experience um, as of today and moving forwards. They now have the VIP um, pass for autistic guests, which is great. Um, it's um, a lanyard that you can wear, um, and it will. It's, it, the park's very much shows, there's a lot of shows to go and see. Um, the VIP pass will make the staff aware that you, you might have um, additional needs. Um, they can seat you near to exits if you need to for the shows. Um, uh, they gave us information on um, you know, which shows would be louder, which shows had um, smells and stuff just in case. And um, they have a family room which they relay some of the, the main shows into, which means that um, if you can't cope with the larger theatre, then you can um, go into the family room to watch the shows. The food is almost ready. Oh, everything's looking so beautiful. The fire is lit and the house is clean. <laughs> I don't know what they would do without me. Oh, I do wonder what would happen if I decided to get married and left them on their own. <laughs> oh, oh well, it's, it's not like I have any plans to, or prospects for that matter. Oh, it's the men in this town, they're all so weak, so soft. The truth is, I think I must scare them away. I wonder why that is. Lazarus! Oh, oh there you are, brother. <coughs> what are you doing carrying oh, that fire right, when you don't feel go. good? No. No, 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 that is Miriam to control her out. You didn't have to do it. Uh, don't say my name that way. You know how I hate it. Really, Lazarus? I, I strongly dislike the way that you are spoiling Miriam. You are ruining that girl. The shows are good, they can be loud, and there is singing involved, so sitting near an exit can be helpful. <laughs> As well as the smaller shows, there are some much larger shows in the huge theatre. Um, it can be very big, very loud in there. So if you don't feel like your child can cope in that theatre, then you can watch those shows in the family room and uh, avoid going in. Or you can sit by the exit and, and leave if you think it's going to be a problem. <laughs> The theming of the Holy Land experience is amazing. Um, it really feels like you're stepping into the Bible. There are various places to eat. Um, we found that the quietest place um, with the least people was the little bistro, which was near the main theater. Um, you could go in there and it was less busy than the main cafe. There's a well-themed kids area um, with a few activities to do, such as beanbag tossing, climbing, um, themed mini golf. Um, that can be quite fun to get away to and play without going to the shows and also there's some gardens that you can wander around that are deliberately kept away from the main activities so that they're quieter and, and a good place to be able to get away from all the people. <laughs> <laughs> 